He may have the next Chuck Thompson or Scott Garceau. He has the pipes and knows the game of football. WMAR 2 News Don Harrison with a young man you don't have to see to know he's a star. It's a typical high school JV football game under the lights. Here comes the announcer. Not the guy on the right, the guy on the left with the white cane. That's Ken Island freshman Tyler Huber. He's blind and he's calling the football game tonight. North Carolina pass falls incomplete. Teray Wright was in coverage. Tyler has been blind since birth. He has the same condition as Stevie Wonder, ROP, retinopathy of prematurity. That'll bring up another Kent Island first down. He's been working on these announcing skills for a long time. And something that he's loved to do ever since he was a little kid, and that was talk. <laughs> so how does all this work? His father, Bill, or Connor Farrell, a history teacher at Kent Island, will lean in and give him a quick rundown of what happened. And then it's all on Tyler. And what is given to me, I, I try to make it my own and in its own unique way. You know, it's funny, when we come to the games, you can't walk around because it's like being with a celebrity. Everyone has to stop and talk to Tyler. Players pull him up in the hallway. Yo, it's it's me, Nate Green. You know, you were the guy who, who called, you called my name like 80 times last, last night. Dead Island makes the stop. Nothing attracts friends more than sports and entertainment, so I had to ask Tyler. How do the ladies react? Oh, <laughs> there are there are some girls that even come up to me after the game and are like, you did so good. <laughs> He's tackled by Jackson Towers for a big game. We're all thinking the same thing. He's blind. He can't see the play. And how does he know when it's a good play? Well, believe me, he feels it. And when he feels it, we all feel it. Nate Green is leaving. He's going to go all the way through. People say that you know when one of your senses doesn't work, the the other four are, are on overdrive mode, and I definitely think that that is definitely true. When the crowd is excited, I try to get them into it, try to get them fired up, for sure. Let's get loud! His whole life has been about adapting things to where he could do it, and he wants to do everything. I mean, he's just a freshman in high school, and I think there's a a lot of world to explore out there. Pressure on the quarterback. And by the looks of it, he's going to have a fun time exploring that world.